Mr. Ernie, are you willing to take Shara, who is standing before you today, to be your wedded wife? Will you love her, honor her, and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep thee only unto her, so long as you both shall live? I do. Give him a hand. Give him a hand. And I can tell you, you didn't hear, but he was in such a hurry to say, I do, that he gave two. <laughs> You're blessed. You get two I do's. <laughs> now it's your turn. Are you willing to take Ernie who is standing before you today to be your wedded husband? Will you love him, honor, serve, and keep him in sickness and in health and forsaking all others? Keep the only unto him so long as he both shall live? I do. Give her a hand. As a pledge. And in token of the vows. And in token of the vows. Between us made with this ring, with this ring I, thee wed, I thee wed in the name of the Lord. Of the Lord. As a pledge and in token of the vows, of the vows between, us made, between us made with this ring, with this ring I, marry I marry you in the name of the Lord. me my heart goes when you touch me my heart goes ready baby my love my love you're the one who understands my love my love you're the one who held my hand my love my love i found a love for Darling, just dive right in Follow my lead well, I found a girl Beautiful and sweet well, I never knew you were the someone Waiting for me Cause we were just kids when we fell in love Not knowing what Still remember the taste of my love. Will your eyes still smile from your cheeks? And darling, I will be loving you till we're 70. Baby, your smiles forever in my mind and memory. I'm thinking about how people fall in love in mysterious ways Thinking now loud, baby, we've found love right where we have known each other for a long time now. And throughout the years, she's come to mean everything to me. I'm so proud of the person that she has become and the life that she's chosen for herself, especially the man she's chosen to spend the rest of her life with. I've read somewhere that love is a friendship that has caught fire, 
May your fire stay strong and bright and filled with love and laughter. Let's drink to right. that. This toast is to the best decision my best friend has ever made. Aww. Big brother. Aww. Thank you, baby. Shara has always known what she wanted. Sometimes it was infuriating because um, she would tell you she wants her sandwich square, cut to the left, that kind of thing. And, but she always knew what she wanted. And among the things that Shara wanted was to be married. Oh my God. She would ask me almost every day, where is he? And how will I know that I have found him? When Samuel poured the oil, it ran. That is it. Shara's oil ran. I won't go <laughs> <laughs> I can't help but reflect on the years I have watched her grow and became the beautiful woman she is today. She endeared my heart the day she was born and I continue to love her. She's my little girl, Squitty Pinky, my princess and my ray of sunlight. And no matter what her age, she will always be those things to me. But today, as I watch her marry a wonderful man, I'm filled with pride and I'm confident that she and Andrew are to embark on a journey filled with love and happiness that can only come as man and wife. So, so we were around two or three years old and we were on the playground at World of Little People and Shara wanted to go on the big red slide. And she, wasn't, she didn't get a chance to go on, all the bigger kids were pushing her aside. So as you can see, I'm, I've always been taller than Shara. We call ourselves Twinny. Can you see the resemblance? So me with my very large, small self went and pushed the other big kids aside and said she wants a turn. And the two of us went down the slide together, and that is how we became friends. <laughs> On behalf of me and my wife. <laughs> we'd like to thank everybody for coming out tonight. We really appreciate it. Sugar, yeah.